Today on Happiest Places Home, we'll brew the perfect pot of coffee. To brew the perfect pot of coffee, you need an automatic drip coffee maker. They're very simple to use, but what we're showing you here today is the little details that make it great. So first, you're going to rinse the basket. You wanna rinse it really well, not just because we're cleaning it, but you want it to be sopping wet for a reason. We'll get to the reason, but first let's talk about grabbing the carafe out of the machine and giving that a great rinse. I like to rinse all parts of it because I use my maker all the time, but if this is your first time, you wanna make sure you're rinsing it really well. Now we're filling the maker and we've chosen to fill it to 10 cups today. I think making a 12 cup pot of coffee doesn't taste as good as just doing 10. Since we're going for perfection here, I like to check that we're at 10 cups on the machine too. And it does show that you can go up to 12, but please don't bother with that. We're using a tablespoon here and we're going for round tablespoons. You can use any type of coffee you want and it's gonna come out great if you use these techniques. But here I'm using two flavored scoops and then the rest are a regular coffee. So you'll want 11 scoops for a 10 cup pot. You'll want one extra scoop for whatever number of cups you're making. I like to spread the coffee out to make sure it's completely level. If there's a dip anywhere in the grounds, the pot of coffee just will not come out as well. Here's why we wanted the basket sopping wet. It's important to take that filter and press it up against the basket. If water seeps in between in the brewing process, your pot of coffee will come out tasting terrible. We're swinging that water arm back in place, closing the lid and pressing the brew button. Another secret is, Wait one minute after it's finished brewing to pour that first cup. It will be worth it. And that's the payoff. Fix your coffee with whatever type of milk, creamer, or sweetener you like, and that's what will make the perfect pot of coffee for you. I hope this video helped you make the perfect pot of coffee, and I hope you enjoy your coffee with whoever you love. I'm about to enjoy mine with my precious little best friend here. There she is. Thank you for watching Happiest Places Home. Please like, share, and subscribe if you like the content here.